It's 4 a.m. and my wife Brittany and I are fishing on the Russian River for sockeye salmon. The way that you fish for these salmon is called flossing. It's an entirely different way of thinking about fishing. Usually when you're fishing, you have a lure at the end of your line, you're trying to trigger the fish to bite that lure. But when you're flossing, you're pulling your line in a weight and across the river, and you're hoping that your line goes through an open salmon's mouth, and then as you pull it across his mouth, it'll feel your fly and clamp down. More often than not, you hook them perfectly right on the inside corner of their jaws. So not the intended species today, but I caught a nice rainbow trout. They're so beautiful in this river, so thick and powerful. The salmon eggs are a great food resource for them, and that's why this river supports so much life. So this is the rig. I've got a regular eight weight fly rod, nothing special. And then I've got a six foot liter of 20 pound fluorocarbon. Halfway down the leader is a one ounce weight, and at the terminal end is a Russian River fly. I adjust my weight to be about the distance from the fly that the water is deep. So if I'm fishing deeper water, I'll slide it up a little bit, but I never go more than six feet from the fly. Oh, there he goes. When it's warm, like today, I think it's 50 degrees. I don't like to wear waders because my waders always leak. But if I just wear shorts and sandals and wool socks, then I'm wet the whole time and I'm not upset that my waders leak. You say when it's warm outside and I look like a swaddled baby. <laughs> 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 Warm as relative. <laughs> these guys off. I'm one shy of my limit right now. I'm allowed one more fish today. Look at how red that is. Holy cats. That is insane. So the reason that our soil is so fertile here is because all these salmon come in from the ocean and they don't eat anything when they're in the river and their bodies die and the nutrients from their bodies feed the river which in turn feeds the forest. So it's important to throw your fish carcasses back in the river when you're done and uh, not in a trash can to fill some sort of landfill. Give it back to nature.